Welcome back to the weekly watch list. I'm Kendra. I love to watch, and this is my reaction to The Walking Dead, The Ones Who Live, Episode 6, The Last Time. This is it, guys. The last episode. Hello. Welcome back. Okay, well, guess what? It's really early in the morning. I've had a lot of coffee. This is the last episode of The One to Live, season one, <laughs> um, from The Walking Dead, starring Rick and Michonne, Denai Guerrera, and Andrew Langdon. Last week's episode was pretty good, especially for Michonne. Uh, Jadis met her end. What an end it was. It was very interesting. Uh, and now we're at the end. Rick and Michonne are headed to the CRM uh, to burn that bitch down. <laughs> The, the description of this episode is Rick and Michonne have to perform a near impossible miracle. Uh, let's see what that miracle is. And once again, I do not believe what everybody's trying to say about Michonne dying or Rick dying. I think this is going to be a very intense episode, a very action packed episode, and a very emotional episode. But I don't think it means that either of them are going to die. Um, I cannot wait. Let's go for the last time. Ah. I remember it all. Oh my God! Is this another letter? Like who we were. Oh my God! My name is Michelle. I lost someone. I'm already getting emotional. This is going to be oh, so emotional. Something I believe the CRM needs to become what it needs to be. This is going to be so good. I'm getting People chills. Oh, God. Do you still love me? Always. Oh, God. It sounds simple, right? We go in, we bring what we know to the city, then go home. Together. It's never that simple. No, it's not that simple. Oh my god, this is heart wrenching! I'm Sergeant Major Rick Grimes. Oh my god, his voice. You probably think I'm dead. Ooh, 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 ooh. The chills, bitch. He said I didn't need to be scared, that it was just the burning. Burn it down, baby! Burn it all down, you know what I'm saying, babe? Okay, I gotta focus, I gotta relax, I gotta chill, I gotta calm down. This is, oh my god, okay. I'm so hyped. Whoa! For the last time, for the last fucking time, bro. They just, he just stroll right up in there. Oh, well, it's good to see you, Thorn. You're really here. What happened? Well, it was turbulence. We, we were going down over water, and Bethune shoved me out. She saved my life. So thank you for bringing her in. Now you brought in. Hmm. Wow, well, smooth operator. But we were just keeping this thing going. I used to think that giving up meant a lack of character. You know, Interesting. a weak will. And now I realize that giving up can be a sign of strength, a commitment to something bigger than oneself. Oh, girl, you are such a bee. Giving up made me understand what we're really doing here. I want to. I'm glad you made it, Rick. You are needed. Does she suspect him? It what is, is this us, but not behavior? Like Okufu said. Okufu, he, he was never really here. Not in the way he should have been. That's why he died. Mm -hmm. But you lived. I lived. We are meant to be a part of this. Ooh, whoa, she is. Ooh. It's time to let go of his bullshit. Oh. Well, show me the other way. Wow, this is a huge base. Okay, girl, Michonne, girl. What? How? What? How? 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 She's good. She's fucking good. She scaled a fucking tree. Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Baby, I love you. 
she's got Nat's key thing. Art. Of course she's got art in there. He wants to talk to you. This is it. Oh wow. So we are getting right into it. Fucking echelon briefing. Let's go. I never had to do my six for citizenship because I I never really became a citizen. Hmm. The end of the world. They haven't used him very much, so I hope that he's we're about to ones, do his They're kinda like them. We're the dead ones, okay. Our scientists haven't figured it out. Rick is a charismatic motherfucker. He got General Beal like, hey, I'm gonna give you some of this weight, buddy. I like you. Okay, or do you have to tear the place up? Michonne, don't panic. Breathe and think. Breathe and think. There you go. Gabriel. And the cat! Aha! What's in the cat? What's in the cat? There it is. And by the way, you're doing this in full view of the windows where everybody can see you. Is that a letter? A long, detailed letter. You got it. Now get the fuck out of there, Michonne. I feel this. I feel this shit here. Deny. 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 Put your gun on the table. Put your guns on the floor and kneel. That prosthetic with the blade. In front of me, away from you. He looks cold in the ass. This is scary. I want you to reflect on all your lives before and after. What's the worst thing you did to make sure someone else survived? Mm. Killed my best friend. Chop a nigga in the head, bit of motherfuckers throw it out. Yeah! Yeah! Lots of stuff, babe. I killed someone with my teeth. <laughs> like they do, sir. I've given this briefing, the Echelon briefing, 2,533 times. Just me and the elite soldier in question. And the soldier in question has never been someone like you. Hmm. I was just thinking, like, and were they A's? Not even this is the first. Thorn. And that couldn't be more appropriate for today. Okafor says, swear on the today. sword. Oh, God, you fine motherfucker. I miss you so much. Oh, my God. Words can't even say it right. You don't have to. I know. Are we crazy? Yes, you are. Oh! <laughs> oh, no. We're I'm certifiable too! I, I went away. I had to. Wait. It was going to be a long briefing. But I came back like you. So, yeah. Feels not stupid. He recognizes an A. Why did you let him live? Why did you let him make it to the echelon briefing? Why y'all drinking this sake or whatever y'all drink? You getting drugged? I well, love how everybody just wears their helmets without question. Was that a bunny? And it's making her think of children and back home. She wants to be back home with her fucking children. You said you saw what the federal forces did at the beginning. Okafor said that they called it clearing disease vectors. I made the decision to take them on ourselves. Second Civil War fought on good Pennsylvania ground. There's about to be another fronts, one. Pittsburgh and Philadelphia. Headed up by the Grimeses. Is... We had an opportunity of terrain, tactics, and the massive incoming dead mass that the federal forces were unaware of. He I used evacuated them. our forces under the cover of night and let the dead overwhelm their troops. I saved Philadelphia by sacrificing Pittsburgh. It's not exactly tearing into a person with your canines, but it's not nothing. No, it's not nothing, sir. My dad taught me, for better or worse, sometimes.
Sometimes things have to burn to bring things back. So are, the are they going to do the same life. thing? Are Rick and Michonne going to let the I dead kill the city, upper echelon of the CRM? Let me tell you the first secret, Grimes. The first one that I share with each frontliner I've briefed. All the fighting and killing, all the plans and sacrifices. What is it? We lose. Most likely outcome is that we're all going to die. Uh. Huh? Y'all are gonna die. Because Rick and Michelle are gonna kill you, but what, what? Why is that a secret? Why is everybody gonna die? Are you gonna nuke the shit? What the fuck? It's the child evacuation protocol. So we were born this way. Oh, you were born this way and you found each other! I guess so. People now have 14 or so years left on this planet. Could be quicker. And it isn't just the delts, it's starvation. Wow. A tenuous balance between population and yield. With a billion petri dishes out there waiting to transmit God knows what to us while it transforms into God knows what. To eventually rot into food for the trees. If that's the first fucking secret, what's the rest? This is why we do what we do. We're trying to beat the odds, Grimes. Oh! Oh! We have over years had operatives enmeshed in the Portland school system to facilitate an evacuation of selected children. CRM destroys community for resources, for strategic superiority, secrecy above all. Once the operation on Portland begins, children will be airlifted away from three school sites before the area is gassed and its population is liquidated. Wow. We have embeds, spies in selected communities. To monitor them. Are there spies in the Commonwealth in Alexandria? <gasps> Politics. Do they know? Do they know? Do they know about them? Omaha didn't just die. We killed it. We destroyed it. And in 18 hours, we will take our final action. We will destroy Portland. You tell the Civic Republic what the CRM does, like the bombing, whatever else they do. If we don't, who will? No one. They know they might die. This is the shit we do. <laughs> oh my god! The Civic Republic military will declare martial law. Stakes are too high for freedom. Whoa. With the city under CRM control and our alliance partners dead, we will march what you across doing? the country and further eliminate any growing competition. We will take their resources and ensure supremacy. They're gonna come anyway! Maybe we get to survive. So they're basically like, we're the only ones who get to survive. We're going to breed the children that we've selected. We've been selecting. We're going to destroy everything else and take all the other resources. Wow. hear what is happening to the city. To be steady. To not give in to the trauma the children will experience or that the participating forces will experience. Anything changes on base, keep walking. I'll get back to you when I can. If I can be gotten back to. You expecting a call? That was Thorn. She went through this. Soldiers should put the children's focus on the comfort items we'll furnish them with. Avoid saying the bunny. it's going to be okay. Just say they will be okay. Wow. I think that the next leader in the next decade is you. That might be you. Wow. You've become a powerful story. One the CRM may need to tell to win the hearts of the this people. This is Okafor's plan, Actually, though. This is what Okafor saw in him. Again. Who's the person closest to you who's died? Carl. My son. He's who I saved, tearing out that man's throat. But you couldn't save him in the end. What if I told you you would never have to suffer that kind of loss again? That wherever you were running Ooh, to, he got that murder look on his to, face. Ooh, 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 ooh. Them safe, you could bring them to us. Family, friends, a love. I don't give a damn. Whoa. They will be spared from our march. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you gonna fucking do, Rick? 
we will begin our march on the countryside, the next world will begin. And through that, somehow, some way, we will survive. The sword that kills is the sword that brings life. Ooh. Swear on the Ooh. sword. Ooh. Let me ask you Woo! Woo! gonna die they're not gonna fucking die rick's not gonna die michelle's not gonna fucking die but here we go here we go here we go pop 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 there we go i can't remember who's going to what floor don't look at it rick Girl, what you gotta do? Where you going? Where you go? What you what, what, what you doing? Oh shit! Oh, you dripping, baby? You dripping, baby? There's just dilts in there. Don't fucking worry about it. Just kill him! Ah! Just get him! What you saying? Fuck it! Which one is which? Baby, baby! Oh! Whoa! Whoa! Rick, you're getting your ass whopped out! Stab him! In the face! Or just bust their fucking shit, Rick! Uh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. We can't go home. Not yet. No. Do you know what they're gonna do? I got the echelon. How she doesn't they even flinch. Happened? They're evacuating the kids. Then it's the whole city of people, Rick. We have to stop them. Because we can't stop them. Is this yours? Yeah. What's in it? Be you. <laughs> Blood covered Rick. I love him. What are you up to, Grimes? Yeah, Beale isn't there. Thorn isn't stupid. Y'all are gonna have to kill her. What we have to do. What sort of a world are we making for them if we walk away from something like this? Oh, I'm mad at the time I missed. I know we can't, but I just... I just want to go back. We are back. What shit are y'all doing, though? You're blowing it up. You're feeding them to the walkers. What you doing? Yeah, you know. You know what's up. Ticking clock for you. Y'all are going to have to kill Thorn. And ha who is, which one of y'all is going to do it? They're going to gas them. Y'all don't have a lot of time. 
Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen? This is the last little part. I should be scared, but I'm not because of you. I have something for you. Oh my god, come on, you guys. Are we trading in the katana for like whatever this Confederate sword thing is? I don't know how I feel about that. Oh! Well, of course. Yeah, you putting it together, babe. She's not gone. Yeah. Oh my god, General Beal! Somebody was like, oh, Beal's gonna be fine. He's not gonna die. Not John Locke. Oh yes, John Locke. <gasps> Whoa! Kill him! Kill him! Where's Beal? I know you lied to me. Dick. Dana. Huh. Dana. Take off your helmets. Michonne, you're gonna have to kill her. You're gonna have to kill her. Kill her. Kill her. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. Don't corner him. When you corner him. And you are going to undo whatever you did. And when I find Beal. You're going to regret this. Ooh. They're going to have to take cover. Never done it. Won't stop it. Can't stop. It. They're going to have to take cover. They're going to have to die for cover. Ooh. Oh. She has a gas mask. You get the other mask. Why you? You got the sword. Don't let her no. toss you. You destroyed our chance. You destroyed the whole world. Oh. Where are you at with that sword, Michelle? His lungs! His lungs! No! Oh god! Michonne! 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 Oh no! Harry! Where is she? Oh! 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 Get her! And hurry up! You were the one he was always trying to get to! How did you get to him? Don't worry about it, bitch! I didn't give me up like you did! Where is he? Rick! Oh my god! No! 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 Where's Rick? Where's Rick? You the gotta get dead. to Rick! In a dead world, love is dead! Well, maybe for you, babe. Oh! Ow! Yeah, it had to be Michonne. Okay. No, it doesn't, but your baby might! Go get your baby! No, 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 he did not, and he is not. This is a callback. Okay, okay, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Rick, you son of a bitch, stop scaring us like that! Of course, this has got to be a callback to say yes when he was trying to get the deer and she thought he was dead, and you're dying, babe. I'm so sorry. Uncle Four is right. They have to hope. Feel. Oh wow! Ah, ah, where's Rick? One hand, baby, get it! You got it! Yes, yes, yes! Now why'd you leave your hand dagger though?
Are you gonna go home? Are you gonna go home? Oh my god! She voted unanimously for emergency oversight over the remaining forces of the CRM. Oh, the city's gonna take over the army. Infantry units did not participate in the atrocities perpetrated by these highest levels of the CRM. Oh, so wow. We're getting the news report telling us everything that happened. They told the city, the city was like, take over this bitch. Free movement! They're opening up the CRM and he's not gonna have a guy! He's not because he's gonna be his family! Oh my god! <gasps> They're turning into a Oh my god, oh my god, he's about to meet his son. 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 Calm down, Kendra. Calm down, Kendra. <sighs> he's got the hat. He's got the hat. Oh my god. Please. Please, my heart. I, I can't. Oh my god. Oh my god. I knew you were still out there. Oh my god. She looks just like Lori and Shane. Meet the little Frank man. Oh my God! Stop it! Stop it! Oh my God! <laughs> I am. But maybe you can call me Dad. Oh, shut up! I knew you come back. <sighs> Cause Judas was. I believe. Oh. <laughs> Everybody, fuck everybody on the planet Earth except them. Where she, girl? Where did you get those pants, Michelle? How did you have time for high fashion? Oh God! Wow! 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 Whoa! Not the helicopters overhead. Oh, no bridge marriage. Who, man? Was it perfect? No, but it was pretty damn close. I'm gonna rate this a 9 out of 10. Let's talk about it. Wow. That was really, really satisfying. I had a gut feeling this whole time that it was gonna be a happy ending because of just everything. Everything that Denai and Andrew have said about the, not only fulfilling the promise of the premise of this entire, you know, series or season, is that it's a love story and it's about love persevering essentially. And that's what perseverance looks like for these people. These amazing, amazing people that they've been showing you and talking about through this whole episode and throughout the season. They are amazing people. And even Bill said to Rick, like, there's a reason that you made it this far. There's a reason that you got to this desk, to this briefing. It's because of all the people, the 2,000 people I've given this briefing to, including Thorne. You know, you're the one who could lead the CRM one day. That whole revelation in the Echelon briefing, like, I suspected, I mean, of course we knew that it was probably gonna be, you know, hey, we got that bombing folk, but the whole thing about the population being, you know, extinct in basically just over a decade, like, that really hit home. It's, of course, of course, it all makes perfect sense, of course. There are millions of walkers out there, or delts, or whatever you want to call them. The dwindling normal human population is susceptible, yeah, to disease, to all of that shit, to the, the fact that they are poisoning the food, or keeping us from the food, or, you know, we try to grow crops, they trample the crops, you know, there's all kinds of considerations that the series has only touched on you know what i mean and and hasn't really even touched on in some cases I, I think except in the last few years when they started exploring and looking into what the crm is and what all of this mystery you know is about so that briefing was like way heavier than what i expected like honestly heavier in the sense that i knew what the crm was up to was sinister but that like just being like okay so we're basically gonna march through the rest of this country 
kill who isn't invited to the party basically and and then you know hold up and survive and we're gonna take the more promising children from all the communities that we've been fucking spying on instead of what rick and michonne did in the end which was give aid open the city up make you know the population stronger throughout through cooperation instead of fucking secrecy and fucking mass murder you know what i mean like and they were showing you throughout the series what kinds of leaders Rick and Michonne are and would be. Basically telling you, signaling, hey, this is the way the CRM leads, but this is the way that Rick and Michonne lead, and this is what the, the actual civil republic needs. Beautiful. Like, I know a lot of people probably think that it was wrapped up a little too cleanly, a little too nicely, but I don't think so. I think it was a six episode series. You know what I mean? Six fucking episodes. They needed to wrap it up and that's how they decided to do it. And I love the fact that even though it went from zero to a hundred, basically like, you know, in 30 seconds, it was so intense. Every moment, I don't think there was a moment wasted. From Thorn just figuring out one or two steps behind them, or you know, one step behind them, what they were up to, or at least that they were up to something, and then like piecing together who Michonne is or Dana, um, to Bill just looking in Rick's eyes and knowing, oh shit, this is not the the moment that I thought that it was, and being able to defend himself before Rick took him out, to Rick taking Bill out. Oh my god, that was so fucking badass, man. That was so fucking badass. And it's perfect that Michonne is the one who took out Thorn. It's perfect. And and it's perfect that what she said was that love doesn't die, bitch. Watch, watch this. All she had to do was remind Thorn of what she was trying to get back to before she gave it all up. And Rick always had that and always had that close and on its way. So it didn't die, unlike what happened with her. Unfortunate, but hey. You know, she had a nice little save moment in the end. And, you know, you can say whatever the hell you want to about RJ or the kid who plays RJ, but that moment when Rick met his son for the first time was just so beautiful and tender. And <sighs> Judith, little Judith, well, she's not little anymore, like always believing that her dad was gonna come home and Michonne looking so fucking beautiful and them just kind of like, owning walking out of a helicopter they done took over the crm they done opened up the civil republic now everybody's gonna actually get to live in that established cooperative safe place and they're gonna have defenders in the crm but it's not gonna be the way it was so i guess in the end okafer's plan worked what he did in keeping rick at the crm and you know, planting this seed in him and to a certain extent Thorn actually helped accomplish what they both set out to accomplish. Um, so that like is Ogilver Gandalf or Ogilver is motherfucking Dumbledore and we got fucking Hermione and Harry over here. But anyway, so yeah, I really loved this series. I think my sister and I we're about to jot down our notes and we're going to do a series review we're going to talk about our favorite parts our not so favorite parts best episodes not so best episodes which you know th like it's hard to say not so best because this whole series was spectacular i'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 because it wasn't perfect but it gave me everything that i wanted to see and it was it didn't even need to be about anybody else but rick michonne and their family for me personally wow i'm so happy that this was the thing that brought me back to youtube and that it was number one on my watch list i really hope you guys have enjoyed watching with me let us talk let us talk in the comments and be on the lookout for my uh the ones who live series review thanks for watching you guys if you like what you see like the video subscribe for more come watch with me i'll see you next time peace